Good evening and welcome to the August uh, 7th Zoning Board of Appeals meeting. Officially call it to order. Um, first thing on the agenda is the approval of prior meeting minutes, but we don't have any yet, so maybe we could do a little scheduling before our meeting, uh, next meeting at, at uh, 7.05. So we just, the night, the, um, is it the 19th? I forget. The yes. The 19th. We have nothing scheduled. No. I don't think anything new has been filed yet. Nat hasn't told me about anything, oh. so no reason to meet if we don't need to, unless you guys. But it could be a continuance. Of well, true. Okay, it's pending where we, but but yeah, pending where we can, what we continue next. But if we don't have anything for the nineteenth, you guys just want to skip that meeting. Yes. yes. I mean, I'll miss you all terribly, but um, yeah. <laughs> I deserve my <laughs> What do you do? Love you. But okay. Um, Remember that's on. <laughs> Okay. You're projecting? <laughs> yeah. So then the, the next meeting would be the 27th, which we should have something for that soon. So anything else um, in the next two minutes that you guys want to discuss? Well, oh, we um, do I'm, have. We talked at one point about um, considering the comprehensive permit fees and other the fees, fees having Adam in. and revisiting those. And is this a time to discuss possibly when we would do that? Do you want to table that as well? No, is that what you wanted to say too? Oh, what, what did you have? I just wanted to know what are the um, what is the resulting action for 106 Woodland? So we'll we'll do that after we do. Okay, yeah, we'll do that on camera. If we're gonna do the fees, I think we should announce it in advance. Oh sure. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So I think we're just picking a night. Oh okay. Yeah. So That's fine. Pick a night. Well, maybe you want to use one of those nights for that. Okay. So if well, we don't know Adam's availability. Right. You know. Well, I talked to him. He's he's available. He could have done it tonight, but he wasn't. Gonna, he's not going to come because everything's getting continued. So, but he'll be here the twenty seventh. I'm I'm projecting. You know. So you want you want me to ask him to to make some time for that too? Yes. Yes. Well, yeah. No, wait a minute. Excuse me a second. Um, you don't want to do it on the nineteenth, right? No, I don't want to have a meeting just for that. Okay. All right. Okay, that's fine. Okay. Um, that's all I've got. Well, all right, we've got to wait. Oh, the uh, meeting that, or the walkthrough of 133 West Union, that's not a meeting. It's not, an, it's not a posted meeting. It's, not a, it's just a, an, an inspection of the uh, I think property. I we're going to post it, though. I think we okay. will post it. Okay. Public income. I forget what day we said that was going to be. Next uh, week. Not this week coming up, right? 20th. <laughs> no, the 20th. It's, it's 20th. Two yeah. weeks out. Yeah, the 20th. The 20th. There's going to be a big turnout for that. If you probably will. Oh, yeah, there it is. Public. Site visit 530. <coughs> That's all right. That's the process. <clears throat> okay. 705. I'm blind. Hold on. Okay, so now we will continue the public hearing uh, for 41 Front Street, special permit for a drive through and I believe the applicants are here. Hi, Kat. Just state your name and. Good evening, Mr. Good Chair, members board. of the board. Um, for the record, Catherine Garahan from the law firm about Itch and Dewey, and with me is Charles Steele from Needham Bank. And we're here to, um, we're uh, further continuing the, the hearing, um, uh, which began on May 25th. And earlier this week, um, the applicant um, sent the board a letter asking for a further continuance um, to allow completion of the town's um, uh, peer review traffic study, which currently um, is anticip anticipated on August 21st. Um, the letter that we sent to you requested a continuance to either um, August 19th or August 27th, which were um, upcoming scheduled meetings of the board. Um, it, it may make no sense to pursue the August 19th meeting where the, the uh, report is expected two days later. So um, the applicant wanted to discuss with you whether continuing to August 28th would, would uh, be agreeable to the board. 27th. I'm, I'm sorry, that's 27th. Right. 27th. <clears throat> I mean, I think that's, 
I think we'll have enough time. To, will you guys have enough time to review? So that, I think that gives us the weekend. Yeah, we'll have the 21st. That gives yeah. us the weekend that review. Time. So That's we'll, reasonable. we'll have enough time if you guys have enough yeah, time. Yeah, and the, the applicant is, ha, um, has a preliminary um, update from FST that the town planner was able to um, to uh, help provide. And we hope to be able to have some, some interaction through the town planner um, on any questions FST has and be able to respond to those so that the report you get on on August 21st is as up to date as possible and has as many responses from the applicant as um, they're able to provide. Okay. And did it, did everyone get the uh, prelim? Did you all get that prelim report from FST? I don't, I don't think so. No. no. Okay. Don't you know, I no. thought it was sent to everyone. I'll send it. They, okay. I guess they only sent it to me, so I'll make sure everyone gets okay. that. Okay. So then, uh, request to continue to the 27th. Um, I'll entertain a motion for what 705 again yeah I move that we uh, approve the uh, request to continue the hearing for 41 Front Street uh, until uh, August 27th at uh, 705 p.m. here as usual as always and uh, move from the, move on forward from there second all in favor aye, aye. aye. opposed okay great Thank we'll you. See you then. Thank you. And I have yep. one housekeeping matter. We have um, right. the memorandums <clears throat> of agreement um, uh, uh, related to the the peer review studies, and they are executed by the bank, but need to be executed by the by the board. So I'll just leave those with you. Sure. So. <clears throat> okay. So we're not going to take any public comment tonight. We'll do. We'll we'll take it up. Uh, on the 27th so if anyone's here for this hearing just please come back on the 27th at 7.05 all right thank you yeah thanks good night I'll see you all then <clears throat> okay so we should sign these I talked to uh, okay it's just my signature I talked to Adam he's reviewed this we, we are no one no one seems to care all right so Good night. Good night. You know what? <coughs> we could have done this with two people. We probably could have, but I wasn't it's sure we were going to get the e email on the um, yeah. on the other one. So <coughs> we have an email. So the next the next agenda item is supposed to start at eight fifteen. Um, it's a continued public hearing for one hundred six uh, Woodland Road variance, but the applicant has withdrawn in writing today. Um, do you want to? You've got it in front of you. you want to read that? Yes. Um, the email is from Deb Montenegro. Uh, it was sent today at 5.25 p.m. And um, it's to the, us, the Zoning Board of Appeals, actualmass.com. Um, zoning ZBA appeal process for D. Montenegro. Uh, please be advised that as of today, August 7, 2014, I am withdrawing my appeal to the Zoning Board for a land transfer between 106 Woodland Road and 104 Woodland Road, signed Deborah Montenegro. So uh, I know we really don't have to do anything. That's up to the applicant. So they've they've withdrawn. So Just that, as a point yeah, of information, please. does that mean that no building will be built? Well, they they might pursue it in a different route, but they're not going to get the, so they they're not going to get the variance. So if they need a variance, they've withdrawn that application. So there's no variance for that. As we discussed, we didn't think that was the right way for them to go anyway. Um, so I think they're going to try to pursue it in a, in a different direction. Yeah, there uh, yesterday when uh, Rob Porter called me, say announcing that uh, the applicant had called, um, there was no reason or no next step given to Roe. Uh, there may not have needed to be. There but, doesn't need to be. Yeah, they, but she just said, you know, is a verbal right. uh, phone call. Right. The matter before us has been withdrawn. That's right. Yeah. That's yeah. all that matters to us. That's right. Yeah. So, so your question is good for a matter of information, but it's irrelevant. For this board, right. So, yeah. okay. So that wraps that one up. Um, so uh, I sounds like you want me to talk to Adam, have him come in on the 27th. So, well, he, he'll be here for, for 41 Front Street anyway. Right. So as soon as that wraps up, we'll just go into the fees discussion. 
I would let him know in advance. Yeah, no, I will. Yeah. I will. I'll definitely give him. For purposes of posting the agenda, do we need to post a time for that, or? I don't think so. That's I think, just I think you should. So well, we don't I need it. it's should. it's internal it's an internal policy so we can discuss that we could discuss that right now if we want to those those are in our internal policies. Oh, we can. Yeah, can sure. Our mention? policies we can do whenever oh. we want. Oh, okay. But, and I don't want to post time because who knows how long Forty One Front Street will go, you know? Yeah. So wouldn't the nineteenth be an appropriate time to have the discussion for the fees if nothing else is scheduled for that day? Well, they want to cancel the meeting for the night. Well, I don't, and plus, I, I don't want to drag Adam here and twice and pay weeks. town council to come in just for that right. one meeting. He'll be here anyway, so we might as well piggyback. And yeah, if if we prime him for that conversation, he can bring whatever his thoughts are uh, and discuss it, and you know, present that to us and say, okay, this is what I right. think it should be. That's what. And yeah. I think we should all review what what they are now and think of what we want to do and. Okay, yeah. so I think that's the only other. I think that's the only other thing we have to discuss right now, yeah, right? Yeah, the things so. on the agenda were, were 41 Front Street, 106 Woodland minutes. Was nothing else. Yeah. Okay, and then we got the site. So the Can next I, thing we'll have is the walk. The walkthrough. Can walk I make a comment yeah, please. about that? Yeah, uh, please. I would encourage you to, you know, it also notify the general public, especially the abutters, because when I attended the conservation yeah. walk through there was a lot of information that was discovered as a result of the abutters providing you know guidance and and even the civil engineer um, uh, was appreciative of new information that they brought forth so okay I'll check with staff to see if what they're doing to announce that I mean it'll be posted so like okay. any other meeting but I don't know if they're gonna send an official notice out to like to the abutters but we're announcing it right now so what do we say it's 5 5 30 on august 20th the zba is doing a site visit for the comprehensive permit at 133 west union street so anyone watching this right now who's interested in that in that ap application they should uh they should join us at 5 30. and is the uh, the civil engineer going to walk you through that i believe so yeah okay I do thank you for representing us. Yeah, I appreciate that. Yeah, you were the only guy with the turned out from CBA. <clears throat> and you folks picked up those documents that were left with Roe? Yes. Right. I sent you. It, mm -hmm. yeah. I didn't. There yeah, were documents with I Roe? sent you an email. I sent everybody an email yeah, sure saying that Roe now has uh, copies of a document that was provided by Mr. Hicks. Oh, great. There were, thank you. Uh, three separate documents right yes so you should pick them up thank you okay i think that is it um i move that we adjourn second all in favor aye aye, aye. 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 okay